What the heck is a smart way to handle a full sheet of 4x8 plywood? Hola woodworkers, Paul Carlson here, small workshop guy. Just got back from the uh, hardwood store where I've got some Baltic birch uh, plywood here and I've wrestled it down off the top of my uh, SUV. I'm going to get a truck soon, uh, particularly so I can go uh, RVing uh, and go visit workshops all over the country. But anyway, in the meantime, I got this SUV. I go down there, they help me put it up on top of the there, and I use some straps, and that's the way I get home. I don't drive too fast, otherwise it lift my whole top off. But, but once I get it home, get it wrestled off, the best way to handle it, of course, is to call your teenagers out of the house, whether those be your children or your grandchildren, and say, hey, help me. But somehow, they are never, ever, ever around when I need them. And when they do help me, they make it seem like it's such an imposition that I just don't want to ask them again. So, so how can, uh, you know, a person that doesn't have, uh, you know, isn't six foot six, doesn't have a wingspan, well, doesn't have the gripping power just to lift that up and carry it, how, how can, uh, in this case, an 80 year old, almost 80 year old, old coot handle this puppy? Well, it's all in leverage. There's no way I can get that up and pick it up and carry it in. But there's a really cool little tool that you can get for not much money. And it's a little plywood carrier. It's designed so that you can put it under that sheet of plywood and then you don't have to get all the way to the bottom. You can get in a position like this. Let me demonstrate. Now, the first thing you gotta do is get this in position. And you want it positioned in the middle of the board. So I'm gonna raise this up here, pretty tall, place it in the middle, or approximately middle. Now, the way this works, and I'll just carry it into my workshop. I'm trying to get it in where I can break it down. So I just get a hold of this here. I'm gonna lift with my back. So now I can get this hand up here and a hand down here and I can lift. Look at that, an old coot with a full sheet. Yeah, I know, it's half inch plywood, not three quarters. But anyway, same concept works. So let me take it in the, into the workshop. All right, so this allows you to get it high enough that you can get it propped up onto your table saw. And then with this as a handle, it just helps you bring that other end up. I don't have room for one of those, uh, you know, carriers that will rotate and stuff, but with this very simple tool, and I'll put a link down below, you, even an old coot can handle a four by eight sheet of plywood. I usually get mine up here and then I cross cut it to get it more manageable. Well, give me a like and a subscription if you would. Trying to produce a whole lot of what the heck is videos designed for beginning woodworkers. Just little tips and techniques that might be searched for later. If you don't like the video, hit the uh, thumbs down button. But, but really, show me you really don't like it and hit that thumbs down button twice. Small workshop guy reminding you you can't stop the waves like this big old piece of plywood, but you can learn to surf. Small workshop guy, signing off. First thing you want to do is probably get the plywood up on your foot. That way you can lift your toe and get this under. <laughs> that way you can lift your toe and get this under. All right, of course, I need it in the center. I don't want it front or back, otherwise that would be very difficult. So 
Again, I just put my foot under there some more. And, uh... <laughs> All right, let's try this again. <laughs> We gotta make sure I edit that off. <laughs> Thank you.